Good morning, Diddy. Good morning. You looking for your daddy? Okay. Oh, oh, where is he? Morning, Maddie. Come here, Maddie. Good morning, guys. We are on our way to the gym, right? Uh, but before we do that, we gotta do the uh, zip fish shake, which it'll be a solo shake today because I'm not having zip fizz. Uh, so in my in my quest for continuous improvement, I'm really trying to remove sucralose from my diet mm -hmm. uh, in any amount that I can. And as much as I love zip fizz, it has sucralose in it. Uh, and so I was like, what is an energy drink that I can have in the morning? Mm -hmm. Because I realized it's not even so much about the electrolytes, don't get me wrong. It's about the caffeine. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, what caffeinated beverage could I have in the morning? And it's also about the mental aspect of like, exactly. ooh, I'm having a beverage, exactly. you know? And Thanks so- you're not a coffee drinker. Exactly, so I was like, oh, let me try these. Beow, beow, beow. Um, Zevia Energy, right? So these are uh, energy drinks. They have more caffeine than like the regular sodas, but more importantly, yes. they only use stevia as a sweetener, right? Yeah. I've kind of just cut out sweeteners on a gamma, I was right? Gonna say, so, cold turkey. Yes. So I'm gonna be having my beverage this morning, but that don't mean that my honey buns. Can't shake his zip fizz and today we are, baby, you have to, yeah, you gotta turn it. Today we are having, bam, blueberry raspberry, which is one of my favorites. Lord knows he would choose one of my favorites on the day when I'm not drinking them, Lord. Only 70 left. Yeah, we don't have a lot left. Basically. And plus, I can't shake my drink or it'd be like a complete different situation. All right. Okay, which some people noticed last time, you gotta put your hand over this in case something happens. You can't just all shake it willy nilly. What if like the, the bottle pops like a freaking thing of champagne and then I'm all sprayed? That's how I live my life. It's, but now you gotta think about me. <laughs> what okay. about me, right. Richard? <laughs> okay, okay, let's get ready to shake okay. it cautiously, all right? Mm -hmm. In three, two, one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go, see? Look how much more secure I feel. Yeah. Ah! You're so cute. You're so cute. Here we go. Blueberry okay. raspberry. Yes. Oh, here. No, now I can now I can open my oh, grapefruit. Look at you. Mm. Grapefruit open up. Okay. I've never had this flavor before. I have had the other two. There was a mango <laughs> ginger. I was like, what are the Girls other ones? It down. And then there's another one that I've had, but I've never had the grapefruits. All right, babe. Cheers to you to and your grapefruit. The love of my life who means so much to me and to your ever loving amazingness and the no here it is the beauty that is you i'm pretty sure See, that's what you said that to me last time beautiful no it doesn't yeah, it sounds like it came from the angels no mm -mm. that's all i'm saying drink very, very angelic. drink mm. you know what guys i'm not gonna lie these aren't great <laughs> They actually taste like sparkling water, like, mm. you know, and I hate sparkling water, but I've kind of, this shows me that I could get used to it because sparkling water has no sweetness yes. whatsoever. It just tastes like bitter carbonation. Mm -hmm. This tastes like slightly bitter co carbonation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like, like stevia mm -hmm. itself is bitter, you know, so. It is interesting. I just taste the grapefruit. Yeah. So like these work great. I think the value of eliminating the sucralose mm -hmm. is worth the like, eh, I don't love these mm -hmm. as much, but you know, it's, well, it's a better it's, sweetener. It's so. also a learned habit too. The more you drink it, the more you probably will like it. Exactly. Just like beer, I'm going to develop a taste for it. I don't know why people want to do that. Okay. We're off to the gym. Upper yes, body. Here we go. Let's oh go. My gosh. Oh yeah. So cute. Okay. for me today it felt great mm -hmm. I really like being able to use the machine yes, so I'm glad to be able to go back to the gym but now I'm glad to go home and uh, get on the bike 
for about an hour, right? Yeah, so you lose me with that. <laughs> so I'm going home today. Is burgers and brats day? I know. So my husband's gonna be out on the grill today. You're welcome for all the footage in advance. Um, and today, yeah, it's just gonna be a good day, busy day, and all of the above. D, all of the above. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so I will catch you when we get home. Okay guys, so we got home from the gym and look who was already here. Like, get you a family that's just at your house more than you're at your house. You know what I'm saying? It's so, like crazy to think like I'm in her house and she's not here. It's just like And I me. get to come home and be like, oh, there's a person at my house. Yeah, I would hate that. Cool. Like, yeah, I can't even, that's crazy. Hey yeah. guys, we just worked out I was, I was gonna apart. say, like, you look like you're in your gym wear too. Like, did you do that? Good on you. What, what is that? Now, Amber, you got a flex. See, look at mine. Ooh, look at that. Is, it, is there anything? No. God, it hurts. Hashtag Not games. Yet. It's going to be real, though. Exactly. I'm making it real, so I don't got to try. It's just there. Let's nice. go, grind season. It's not too late for that summertime body. It's not too late for that summertime fun. We ain't going for the summertime. We're going for the long time. I want to be on somebody's beach December 31st. So you know what that means? That means I got to be in shape on December 31st. I can't be summertime fun and then fall off. Like, like let's get on and let's stay on. Let's go. Oh my God. My ears. More of this at Keto Palooza. I have my best body on for y'all. I'm matching. Let's match energies though. What yeah. waist? Yeah. No tan lines. I don't even know what that means. Okay. I mean, so in, in, in that, yeah, we're going to talk for a couple minutes. Then I'm getting on my bike because I got hashtag goals. You know what I'm talking about? So just go. Bye. No, no. Okay, guys. I'm on the bike. I'm about to finish up. I'm breaking a sweat right now. The sun is shining right through the window right there. Ugh, I'm feeling great, but... I'm tired and I want to stop so okay guys it is time to eat my first meal of the day as usual I am sticking with my cello wisps my cheese snacks and then jerky but switching it up a little bit because instead of the Tillamook beef jerky I actually made my own jerky you guys take a look at that can you see the jerky texture what what are you in there doing I am making jerky so I just dumped in the marinade my steak my bottom round yeah, your bottom round. My bottom round has been marinating for a couple of days at this point. I honestly forgot about it. So. Ooh, look at what we're doing. Oh, we are so good at this dehydrating thing. We are nailing dehydrating stuff, right? Yeah. So I just took it out of the, the marinade. I used some Worcestershire, a little bit of soy sauce. I used some beef broth, used some liquid smoke, mm. and then... I put oh some hot sauce and some cayenne Ooh. pepper. And we're drying them out from yeah, all the Yeah, you gotta pat them dry, apparently, allegedly. <laughs> That's what they tell us. Yeah, and so we're putting them on our dehydrator tray mm -hmm. to go into the ninja. Ooh, easy peasy. Yeah, easy peasy jerky to dehydrate. Squeeze. Like, I just Googled how to make your own jerky because I was like, if I'm gonna be eating be jerky it's gonna get expensive you know and so I just googled how to make beef jerky and this is like bottom round that I just bought from the store I had the butcher slice it really thin um I didn't realize that they would turn into like meat fries like that's essentially what happened they're like they're like meat fries meat cigarettes if you will right so um I put them in the dehydrator so my, my ninja foodie dehydrator 150 for five hours and, and they're great look mmm mmm oh Tough, chewy, budget friendly. Mmm. It was super easy to make, and I'll definitely be doing that moving forward. Then I got my cello wisps. These are the Asiago. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Lunchtime, it's burger and brat. Let go. <laughs> She's doing good boy. Mmm. Hi, BJ. Hi, old man. Hi, old man. Hi, old man. Winston. Winston, what are you doing? What are you doing, buds? What is my boy doing? Winston, are you hiding? Are you partially hiding? You hiding a little bit? Hey guys, so my wife left me and wants me to cook. Oh, she didn't leave me, but she went to the shop without me. You know how to be, you know what I mean. So, this is me throwing stuff on the grill to please my wife. And of course, her usual brat. Can you see it? Yeah, can y'all see? Can y'all see it? The work happening? 
it. And after this, we go burger. I'm about to throw the burgers on now. Should only take about 10, 15 minutes. I forgot who I'm cooking for. Should take about 25 minutes. Yeah. My wife loves almost burnt food. Mm, that's my life. All right, so let's check on the food. Here it is. As you can see, I snuck on some pork chops. That's for me. Alrighty. Almost finished. Let's seal it up. Okay. And there we go. I got all of my wife's brats nice and charred like she likes them. And a nice, super crispy burger. Again. I, I, I don't know where this is going. This is what she loves. So, away we go. I have just come home to the most beautiful sight. My husband has grilled me some meats. Oh, they look so good. I've been at the shop working and I'm so excited to finally be able to eat. Oh, geez. All the meats. The most beautiful sight in the world. <sighs> what are you doing, Alan? Just kidding. There goes the most beautiful oh, sight in the world. Good. Don't do it. No. We got two hamburgers in the microwave, but while those are heating up, like, I just couldn't wait. Like, I had to take one of my husband's deliciously charred brats that he made for me. Mmm. Mmm. And dig right in. It's the crust. Mm-hmm. Mmm. The burnt crispiness. Mmm. Don't need no mustard. Don't need no hot sauce. Don't need no bun. Hello. It's the char. All right, stop. Burger time. Oh, see what I did right there? Oh, look at these deliciously beautiful mm, cheeseburgers. So I didn't have bacon this week and you know what? I'm honestly not missing it. Like that is just so crazy what we think we need in our diet and we don't. Okay, so first of all, what I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna scoop some of this cheese up right here because this is like a side dish to the actual burgers. It's just, it's just like extra cheese. That's the side dish. Mmm. It's just so hearty. It's just so savory and sharp. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm gonna take, oh my God, I don't even know if I can bite into one of these things. You see all that steam coming off there? I ain't trying to die today. Absolutely not. Look at this cheese skirt. Oh, this is like out of a comic or something. Okay, I'm gonna take a small bite. I'm not trying to die. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Beefy, tangy from the mustard. Hot from the hot sauce, just deliciously unctuous from the sharp cheddar cheese. This is delicious. Mmm, hot. Mm-hmm. You guys, so I am drinking like my water today, but I wanted to show you. I bought this little glass infuser pitcher from Walmart a couple of weeks ago. You see in the middle there, it has like an infuser core, right? So I just chopped up a lemon put some in there and I've just been using this to drink out of and I'm not gonna lie, I absolutely love it. Plus this thing is like 60 ounces, so it's like a great measure of how much water I need to have in a day. Like as long as I have at least one of these, then I'm doing a good job. Comment down below, how often should I be changing the lemons in here? Like how long can they last before you're like, nah dog, you need to get a new lemon. Like. I've been doing it like every three days. Is that too often? Not often enough? Like, let me know. I'm, I'm a newbie to the whole infusing game, but I like it. Oh, hey. Hey, everybody. You see me and my wife? Do they see you and your wife? Mm. All right, talk about your food. That's what I was going to do anyway. Mm. Okay, believe it or not, this is actually me trying to have less cheese. <laughs> like, uh, I had, like, burgers topped in cheese. I'm having my skillet pizza which is just pepperonis and cheese. So this is just pepperonis on a plate with one ounce of cheddar cheese, one ounce of mozzarella cheese, and then I put some 
oregano and some red pepper flake and some salt on here and I just put it in the microwave for two minutes and this is literally what happens like if I was like super brave I would like lift this and flip it over my head but not today I just got my hair in you know what I'm talking about so we're not out here taking those risks but we are out here trying this dish did that kind of rhyme what okay see this is what I absolutely love because like the cheese on the end gets like really burnt and crispy but then the cheese in the middle is still stringy and chewy and then that's also the same for the pepperoni some pieces are really crispy but then some pieces are really tender so simple so satisfying so delicious so stuck together okay guys i'm done with everything for the day i didn't have anything after the skillet pizza like no sweets no nothing like it was a boring day but I need more of those. I'm having a Zevia, I'm not gonna lie. I really do love these. So crisp. So crisp. My husband's it so like crisp. Mm-hmm. What are you doing a commercial for? Zevia. Zevia, they're really good. My arm's getting tired from the gym today. I can't hold the I can't hold it up any I can't hold oh bye. Okay, so we're gonna call it a day because there is no food left to eat. There's nothing mm -hmm. left to eat. So I'm going to finish my orange Zevia mm -hmm. and then we're going to watch some TV. I'm watching Pose. Yes, you are. Uh, it's good. I'm, still, I'm catching it when I'm working. Too, you are. So you are you're, working you're a lot today. Your, you're having so. your run on Netflix. Yeah, I'm having my run on but Netflix. I, I come in and poke in and laugh every now and then. Yes, it's, he does. It's hilarious. Add some color commentary, right? As we know, Richard can. So I'm going to sit back down. We did a lot today and I'm going to geared up get ready for tomorrow so thanks so much for watching don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and comment down below and share and subscribe to our channel watch autumn keto and we'll see you next week bye goodbye oh thank you i told you i was i'm wobbly babe i've been to the gym i've been to oh you're a sleepy boy Oh Lord, the dogs are meeting BJ. BJ and DJ, the best of friends. Let me give a good shot of you. Make him see it jerky. She had already, like, she was, I mean. Stop talking about them.